When dealing with calendars, adding third-party calendars can really help if you want to keep track of how many uh, of uh, the uh, appointments have been made and also a constant update on your actual calendar, let's say a Google Calendar, and having it blocked to make sure that there's no double booking. So to do that, there needs to be an integration between your uh, calendar uh, provider and Squarespace scheduling. I'm just going to show you how to do that. We scroll down to where it says sync with other calendars. In this case, I'm going to sync with a Google Calendar. All you have to do is to click connect to Google Calendar. Then click the calendar that you want to, the account that you want to be connected to. Click allow. And there you go, we are connected to a calendar. There are just a few settings that you'd need to make. Here, uh, the calendar that we have here is um, the main calendar is here. I simply click the main calendar. That's where uh, the appointments will be posted to. And if it happens that uh, an appointment is made in Squarespace scheduling and it's put in my calendar, then it blocks that time to avoid double booking. Also, you can set reminders just uh, a few minutes before an appointment uh, occurs. Here it says 15 minutes. I'm not going to put that reminder, but it would be handy as well. Um, and this setting, you can also hide uh, the title of the meeting in the calendar and show it is busy to others who have access to that calendar. So after that, you simply say save. And it's done. You're connected. So generally, that's how you sync uh, your uh, third-party calendars with Squarespace scheduling.